Hi, I'm Anya. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I would like to show you how to prepare uh, chicken pate. Uh, we call it uh, pasta drobiowy. It is delicious. It is very delicate. It's um, minced meat baked like a pie. It's like a chicken pie, but it's not really a chicken pie. I hope you guys are going to be curious enough to give it a try. And in case you decide to do that, let's have a look at the ingredients so you know what you need. I'm starting with uh, transferring my uh, chicken into the large pot. I washed it before. I'm adding my vegetables, my leek, carrot, parsley, celery, and half of my onion. Then I'm going to cover it completely with water and add some salt. It's actually a teaspoon of salt, bay leaf, allspice, my uh, peppercorns and dried mushrooms. I'm going to cook it for around an hour or until the meat gets easily off the bones from the chicken. Then I'm going to slice my onion into thick slices and fry it on the two tablespoons of oil until my onion gets soft. Then I'm going to add my liver which I washed before and removed any fatty tissue I did not like. And I'm going to cook it for around 4-5 minutes I would say until it looks like this and it's um, fully cooked through. Then it's time to fish our vegetables and chicken out of the chicken stock which we need to reserve because we'll still need it. And then we're going to take off the meat uh, from the bones of the chicken. And then we uh, soak our dinner rolls in the chicken stock and it's time to use our grinder. We're going to grind our chicken, our liver together with onion and I'm as well grinding my vegetables, which is a little bit untraditional, I would say, but it really tastes good. Then it's time to uh, uh, separate our eggs. I have to mention we have to grind all the meats twice because we want nice creamy texture to our meat mixture. Okay, we separated our eggs and then it's time to beat our egg whites until they reach stiff peaks. Okay, here we go. Then we're going to grate our garlic, add salt and pepper, our marjoram, nutmeg and our egg yolks. Then we're going to give a good stir and then we're going to try it if it's uh, seasoned enough and in my case I had to add some salt and then the final step we add our egg whites and fold them in gently here we go then I'm going to line my uh, loaf pan with uh, aluminium foil and I'm going to spray it with a non-stick spray then we transfer our meat level it nicely and decorate it on top with some sliced almonds and this goes into preheated oven to 180 degrees celsius for one hour we're going to let it stand for around 15 20 minutes before we remove it from the pan but we're going to cut it when it's cooled down completely because otherwise it's going to fall apart i hope guys you like the recipe as usually let me know what you think and i will see you next time bye Thank you.